and welcome to Vallejo Sports here on Vallejo Community Access Television. We're here at Amar Armillo High School here in Fairfield, California at the Women's Varsity Armillo Indians versus the Benicia Panthers of Benicia, California. Today's coaches for the Benicia Panthers, Coach Randy Sates, and for the Armillo Indians varsity, Lawrence Trigg. And our Mio Indians start off in possession and putting the first two points on the board, number 20, Kyra Wilson. Number four for the Panthers, Cameron Hatcher. And it's like for number 20, two pointer by number by Kira Kyra Wilson. And a nice three-pointer by number 23, Mendoza. Number 40, straight up for the Armenio Indians, Passion Wear. Nice two-point jumper by number 20, Kyra Wilson. And Jada Williams sent to the line. Jada Williams making two foul shots and make that three. And a nice one by 23, Mendoza. Nice three-pointer by number three, Cameron Hatcher for the Venetia Panthers. Michelle Lee, straight up for two. That's a timeout. Varsity coach for the Venetia Panthers, Randy Sates. For the Armillo Indians and the Venetia Panthers here at Amar Armillo High School in Fairfield, California. You're watching Vallejo Sports 
here on Vallejo Community Access Television, Channel 27 Comcast, and Channel 99 AT&T. Michelle Lee, number three for the Panthers. Number 10, Jada Williams to the line. And making that first foul shot. Michelle Lee. Off the middle. Especially with all the uh, physical contact. And a nice two-pointer by number 13, Tiffany Mestas. And a nice one by Number 20, Kyra Wilson for the, and the Indians turning it on and taking back the lead. Two pointer scored by number 10, Jada Williams. And puts the Indians at 20. So the Benicia Panthers, 18. The Indians have taken the lead. And a nice one. The lead was by 33. Faith. For the Panthers. And number 40, Passion Ware. And Michelle Lee. The hard two points. Pressing it, tying it up with the Indians. 22 to 22. And the Indians take the lead back to 24 to the Benicia Panthers, 22. There is the work of the Armeo Indians media department taking pictures here during the game and displaying them right here in the gym. Nice to see other videographers and camera crews of the uh, school involved in after school projects such as sports. One turnover after another was a sign. And that looked like that was Michelle Lee with the layup. Tying it up with the Indians. 24 to 24. And number 40 again. Putting the Indians at a lead, two-point lead. 
The Indians at 26. The foul sends Passion Ware to the line. Five minutes and 55 seconds. Struggling to put some points on the board, and just as I say that, number 32 puts three. Looks like that was 22, 23. Mendoza for the Panthers. Panthers trailing by one at 27 to the Indians 28. Three minutes and 32 seconds left here in the third quarter. And ties it up with the Indians at 28 to 28 of the local games there and a steal and it paying off looked like by number 13 Tiffany Mestas and a backwards Layup by Michelle Lee, number three, for the Panthers to the line for two. And Bluford puts two points on the board. Putting the... And Michelle Lee is one of the players who had the opportunity to play on last year's team. And she makes both free throw shots, tying it back up with the Indians. 32 to 32. And 13. Tiffany Mestas. Sending Monzo. Naomi Monzo to the line for two. And the Indians lead by four at 36 to the Panthers, 32. A nice three-pointer by number 12, Destiny Bluford. Passion Ware bringing the Indians to 39. A seven point lead. And she puts it at an eight point lead. They only have three fouls on the board to the Panthers 10.
Number 12, Destiny Bluford. It looks like the fourth quarter fatigue setting in on the Panthers. And number four with the three-pointer, Cameron Hatcher. Five minutes and 42 seconds. And Michelle Lee taking it to the hole. Putting the definitely not a smart pass. Try to squeeze that through uh, Passion Wear. And number 11 with the three pointer, Lauren Williams. 46 to 36. Indians in the lead by 10. Swing to the outside. And another three-pointer by number 11, Lauren Williams. Panthers losing their place. Number 20, Kyra Wilson. And a timeout called by Lawrence Trigg. And the Indians keeping a lead and holding the lead at 54 to the Panthers 37. Five, up for two. Keli. And number 23 with the fadeaway. Mendoza coming to a close. Number 14 with the three point attempt. And a nice three-pointer by number 23, Mendoza for the Benicia Panthers. And the Armeo Indians win the women's varsity game, basketball game at 54 to the Benicia Panthers 43. You've been watching Vallejo Sports here on Vallejo Community Access Television. I'm your host and commentator, Tim Banks. And we thank you for watching. Be sure to look for television schedules and game schedules. They're on VallejoSports.net.